welcome back to the channel. I'm excited today because we're getting back on this 350. We're gonna start gathering up everything that we got for it. We already got this out here. So we need to gather up and see what all we have because we gotta start putting this thing together. So what we're gonna do is we'll lay out this table full of everything. We're gonna start cleaning on the parts that need, like, you know, it's been sitting, it's all dusty yeah. and stuff. Get everything all cleaned up. And we're not painting the Mustang right now because we're having to get some more time available. Yeah, we got to get more time available because, you know, we still are dealing with my wife's healing. She's getting better. And work's been busy. And work has been slammed, which I'm blessed. And I thank God for that because you don't always promise work when you work for yourself. Yep. But but we've been very blessed. So, guys, uh, what we're going to do is let's start. Look at this place. We got to find all the parts. Oh, Hunter's no. been trying to put all of her tools away, which is an act of congress because, i'll show you a couple of drawers in this yeah, video yeah i mean it, it's just we're gonna have to get some more organizing stuff but guys we're gonna have to try to get this motor together so we get it out of the way we need to get get all the space we can get and then we'll probably tape up the mustang a little bit while doing some different things if we have time without filming it because yeah. you don't want to watch us tape this thing up. yeah that is so uh guys let's get to work all right guys i got some parts and you know what they say about chrome It'll get you home. Oh, yeah. I don't care what anybody says. That looks good. So we got our pulleys, our alternator bracket. Our alternator bracket. That's a cool design one. Yeah, I like it. Uh, so we have that. That's pretty cool, man. We this just got to find everything else. Water pump. Look yeah. at that. Looks good. All right, let's see what else we can find. Come on, let's get to it. Look at this. Now that's going to be sick. Oh, Oh, I, I wonder if uh, the aluminum and chrome would look good together, guys. Comment down below, because... It does to me. I think it'll look like that. Oh. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I think we'll... I think that'd be it, boys. And if we end up not cha changing it yeah, later... because I have another one I'm going to find here in a minute, because we might paint it and see which one looks best. Yeah, but, but of course, I love the aluminum. I the aluminum, aluminum looks looks amazing. So we have that. We have... What else do we have over there? Oh, my goodness, yes. Dude, I think we hit the mother load. What's that? Freeze oh, out yeah. all the freeze up plugs. That's good. So put that over there. Add more to the pile. We just gotta see what all we got. We've had the shop kind of in shambles uh, for a long time, having to move parts around. Yeah. So finding everything's gonna be uh, a little fun. Yeah, but guys, I'm telling you. Hey, look, there's another chisel. We got tons Lunch. of those. Yeah, we do. We have tons of them. Look at all these. Oh, I didn't even know we had those. <laughs> so, is that our gasket kit over there? Oh, okay. Yeah. Yes, this is great. great. Yep. There we go. So, we're going to look around and see if we can find anything else. All right, guys. What? Oh, yeah, baby. Ooh, that's nice. There we go. That looks nicer than the one on 283. I don't know, but, you know, this is for the... Uh, a the Apache. Apache, it's gonna look good. So this thing's gonna be decked out, ain't it? Let's look at that right there. Yeah, look at that. That's nice. All this. We got all of our gaskets. I'm super excited about this intake. This is gonna be sick. We gotta order these. Because the that's AM one thing lines. I know we don't have so yeah. far. So uh, I guess I gotta just keep digging, guys. So I'll get with you right here in a second. We'll see what all we got. All right, guys, I got the, the rockers and stuff in here. Head bolts. All this uh, in here. Good old pump. Uh, all that good everything stuff. you need push rods we got our timing that. chain the double that's cool double and then we found a chrome timing chain cover and then this was the one we thought about painting painting it black to match the engine or we'll go with the chrome or the, the aluminum. aluminum we're gonna let y'all decide that so yeah comment just down let us know down, down below which one should we use because I mean, aluminum looks cool, but this chrome, Hunter's got a stuff at home. I got a polish here. I can polish, polish that it. thing up. We're gonna see how it looks. Because with, this is chrome. If you chrome that, I mean, it might look sick. It uh, would. We'll see. We'll but see. we got to get our valve covers, and then we're gonna go paint outside because we're losing daylight, and we gotta do it real quick. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is paint this. Yep. And. Uh, our valve covers tomorrow because we went down to O'Reilly's. We had yep. to order the paint we're doing the color scheme on our motor. It's you'll see cool. what it's gonna be. It's gonna match the truck, so we can't wait to get this thing going. We're excited. If we can get this motor put together, we can get the chassis in here and go ahead and drop the motor on it. Yeah, that'd be cool. Maybe. It'd make it easier setting the motor. Yeah, before we get the cab on it. But Let's then, just hope that the truck sits down good on it. Yeah. So that we don't have to make a custom transmission tunnel. 
I really hope we don't. I think it. it'll be fine. So it seemed pretty high up, and I, it'll probably uh, fit. So guys, I think we have almost everything. I know I'm gonna have to buy bolts for the intake, intake, which I bought them for the the 283. I'll buy the same ones, and uh, I I don't know what else we'll need. I think we have a chrome. Uh, uh, thermostat. Thermostat. You know this thing don't don't uh, thermostat right here. Yeah. That's for uh, the, distributor. The but this uh, this does not take a thermostat. Cause see how it's made. Yeah. Where did you put it at? I don't think you put a thermostat with this. I don't know. I have this guys. If you know down there, what 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 kind of thermostat do you use if if it's like this? Do you use one? I Just mean, let I us know, know down below. We don't know. Below. So guys, let us know. We're gonna paint this, and we'll, then we'll have either black chrome or aluminum it's up to y'all whatever because we can always use that aluminum when we build our 400 yeah i mean we can because we got a 400 sitting over there that's going to be the next build on the well, next engine build. engine build yeah uh so guys uh let's get to work I trust you this much, Hunter. I'll hold it while you hit it. No, it's fine. We almost got, we got it. it. Get yeah, it I'll get it. I must really trust you. I have to do some hammer dolly. Just kidding. It's gonna be good. Hey, I love this thing. This drill's good. Battery's almost dead too. Look, so. guys, this is what we're working on. We're working on the heart for this thing. Oh, yeah, it's going to be sick. Ooh, I can't wait. Even that busted window looks nice. <laughs> no, but I do like the front windshield on this thing. It's, I'm glad it's all there. So we got to get this thing painted because the sun is going down. Is there going to be any in it? You might have to enough. take the lid off of it and pour it out. You know that? Cause we gotta get some more. Yeah, we need to do that. Which we need to do it before we paint the Mustang. Yeah, we've been. We just ain't had time to go by there. I don't even think there's any even in there. Oh, there's, oh, there's a little bit, it. just enough for it. All right. I cleaned up pretty good with just that wire wheel. Wire wheels are perfect for this kind of stuff. I mean, we don't know if we're even going to use this one, but I'm gonna go ahead and have it painted just in case. Yeah, because y'all decide down below what you want us to do. Let's get to painting. Don't no. spray it in your mouth. <laughs> I think I put a big glob right there. I think it'll be all right. I'll just coat a little bit and then... Yeah, it'll be all right. It's honestly going to look pretty good. Yeah, black. Black looks good on anything. Yeah, it does. You know, just in case you have an oil leak, you don't see it. <laughs> You notice we have went black with a lot of our vehicles already. I know. We like black. It just looks really good. Now, it gives dry, it the sinister look. Like mad. Yeah, it's supposed to. So it's going to be good. I'm okay. super excited. You got to hit over here a little bit. You missed the big spot. I did right here, too. I like uh, this table we're using. came in handy. Yeah. <laughs> you see right here? Yeah. I didn't get none of the round that. Oh, okay. I just got the flat surface. It's going good. All right, guys, we might use this. I believe this is a point distributor, which we can use our new snap on a point alignment point tool. alignment tool. I don't mean we I might go with a different one, but this is what we have right now. This is what we have. I mean, because we're trying to do a budget build, aren't we? That so was we, our goal to begin with. Yeah, but now we're getting a little because just our. Uh, but this engine wasn't supposed to be for the truck. Supposed to be for the rat rod, but we decided to put the truck in front of the rat rod. Yeah, because we, we decided to put the... Woo, Hunter, here it is, baby. What is it? Oh, yeah. Take those over there. Is that our rings? Yep, rings in. Uh, oh. 
We're running out of room on the table. <laughs> you finding everything? Lifters. I knew I had these lifters put away. We've had a lot of stuff just put away in different areas. Well, we've been building up for this build right here. We've been, so it, it's scattered everywhere. Like the valve covers, I can't find yet. So I'm looking for them. Because we want this to go quicker than the 283. Yeah. Since we will have the parts already. That's why we waited. Because we wanted to gather up most all the parts so we could put it together. I don't know if we'll use this one. If you could do something with this one. Uh, I might be able to polish it up, but I don't know about that bottom. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. We'll, we'll see. We'll put it over here. So I, I think I have another one, too. So let's keep searching. All right, guys. Well, we have these that we could get powder coated, whatever color we want to do. That would be pretty so cool. We, we also have these. We have that we was going to use, but we, instead we got the double roller. Yeah, sorry it's a little dark. It's just in, it's yeah, in a cabinet. Yeah, it's in a cabinet. Look, we have these cams. These are for stock uh, 350s. Yeah, we got but a lot we, of cams. What did we put that in that cam in it? A 480, didn't 480, we? 480, yeah. 480. Same thing in the 283. Yeah, but we put it in the 350. So we have our, our water pumps here. We have more lifters and, and rockers. And gosh, dude, we could build a few motors. That's going to be good, though. Guys, I'm telling you, what you do is you start gathering things up, and that's what we've done, just a little bit When you here, find the opportunity to get something, there. and it's not a bad price, you get it because you can build up stuff. Yeah, and what we're planning on doing was, is cleaning some of this out. And putting some of our cases from our tools and, and in one here. In one of these. Probably the very bottom one. Yeah, because that one's probably the easiest to clean out. We yeah. can put all that into this one. Oh, but there's our heads. Here's our heads for a 350. We got a... That's going to be a video on its own. There's an original intake we're, we're not going to use. Yeah, there's a... In, we have an intake there. An aluminum one up here. Aluminum one up there. We have another one right there. Then we have three intakes. Hey, this pretty is, good. This uh, is that Crazy Dave. Yeah, that is Crazy Dave. That's what he used on... Uh, what oh, was that on? He used it on uh, our uh, valves. Like oh, yeah. We, uh, polished and yeah. stuff like that. Guys... So what we're looking for is, uh, well, we found the heads. I have Valve covers. There's another cam. Do we have another? Is that? Yeah. That's, that's, not a, that's a 350 cam I know. too. So guys, we have cams. We too. need to buy the cam cases you can store them in. Yeah. It's for we better. Need them really, we need to put them in something. To store it. Uh, so let's look for these valve these, covers. Yeah, valve covers. That's what it is. I mean, it's a mess. So let's find it. All right, guys. So you remember, does everybody remember this thing? You remember we shot the geyser out of the... Oh, yeah, the oil. But I'm glad we have that. I'm so glad that can, came with the Nova. We can prime her. Or, oh, money. There they are. Those are going to look killer when we clean them. Oh, and, and there's... Okay, goodness, we're getting the stuff together, Oh, our oil pan's over yes, there. Yes, there's our oil pan. We're going to paint that black tonight, too. Yep, so let's get so to let's it. let's get to it. We're going to be painting this oil pan mm -hmm. black. We got it cleaned up. Yeah. I, I wanted to go with the aluminum one. But right someone, now, someone oh. tried to paint it aluminum. Oh yeah, well, hey, we have aluminum paint. <laughs> hey, what do you think? <laughs> now let's I'm go black. black. I want to do this motor. We're gonna do a, a, a we're going black and red scheme on this thing. Oh man, you let the cat out of the bag before we get the paint. Okay, guys, we we are we're doing it. You broke the lid again. I, you know, I just don't need to touch stuff, do I? No, you squeeze stuff too hard. You know, I'm about done a hundred. Oh, spray it out your face. Yeah, <laughs> I can't believe I did that. That was a long night though. I mean, I want to jump on a time lapse for this. Yeah. All right, guys, what we're doing is we're going to paint these red. Oh yeah, that's going to look good. That's, go that's going to look really cool. So we went down there to O'Reilly's and we ordered a red. They're supposed to be in tomorrow. So we got red. That's going to be red, black, chrome. Then of course, you know, I can't, you can't do nothing about the blue and the red, but no, I, that's I like that look. It still looked pretty cool, cause dude, look at all this stuff we've got. It's a whole lot. <coughs> pollen choked up. It's all the pollen in there. Yeah, it's like pretty bad around here right now. But guys, we still have a lot of tools we got to put away, and and but guys, three fifty build. I think we have everything. Um, if not almost everything. Almost everything. I mean, I, I have. I mean, it looks like pretty much everything to build this thing back because our pistons are back here. Hey, that's one thing we got to clean the pistons. Yeah, we'll do that. Yeah, we, we'll get the pistons, we'll clean them. And it might not be in this video though. Yeah, it might not. Cause I mean, just finding all this stuff's taking a while and getting it all together. And then Crazy Dave's gonna have to come over cause these are 
uh, fall to fit. Um, we got it a little bit bigger so we can get. Yeah, so we can get where we can make it the compression that we want. Yeah. So that's why we, it's cool that we got the filler gauges now so we can do I this. I know. I don't know how to do it, but Crazy Dave's going to teach us. He's done it a thousand times. Yeah, and, uh, you know, building race cars, you learn that stuff. So we're going to learn how to do it ourselves. And this motor's looking good because, look, I mean, we've we done all that work to this. And Honed it, looks, it and everything. It looks, it looks really so good. good. And I mean, if you if you follow along with this 350 build, you remember how bad this was. This thing looks good now. Yeah, it does. Now it's orange over here. We still got to paint that black. But I'm thinking, guys, let us know down there in the comment box. Should we paint the thing, then knock out the plugs and leave these? Uh, that might look pretty cool. Leave these. Uh, that, what uh, color is that? Goldish brass? color brass. I don't know. Yeah, should we do that or should we just put them in and then paint it? All so together? just comment down below. Comment below. So what what we're asking, guys. Aluminum, chrome, we'll, or probably, the we'll probably take this home tonight and do some work on this. Uh, or the painted. The painted looks pretty good black. It does. I think we gotta go spray some more coats, so let's head on yeah, to let's it. Let's do it. Getting the last coat sprayed on there. It looks so good. Yeah, I, I kinda like the black oil pan. Kinda hides the little dings. Yep. <laughs> uh, really makes them stick out where Yeah, but it's gonna be in the car and probably get more dings because it's gonna be low. Yeah, because you know the chassis we're putting this on is slam. I'm so excited for it, so guys, we're just excited can't about wait. this build right here. This is gonna be fun. It might be time consuming though. But we're gonna finish painting this off camera because it's kind of boring to watch paint dry. I like one watching paint dry. <laughs> I'm joking. I want you to check this out. Our buddy Steve, he gave us this right here. Screwdriver holder. I mean, that is awesome. And we got more screwdrivers. I know. That we just got to clean up. Not counting the ones that are in here. Yeah, that's our good screwdrivers. I mean, there's some good there's screwdrivers. There's good screwdrivers. Here. It's just we don't have enough frame in our toolbox yeah, for and them. Uh, pry bars. Look at all the pry bars. I mean, and this thing, this thing come in handy, man. I love it. And it's in a perfect spot for us. Yeah. And, uh, but we, guys, we also have some headlights because we got, we got a lot of, Work we're gonna do on that uh, Apache. We'll have to have all the lighting we yeah. get. We and gotta we figure. gotta organize a little better because it's not the best. Yes, but this box it and this one looks pretty. This good. This one looks pretty good. But this one needs some work. Like, yeah, I mean, all those SKs. <laughs> but guys, uh, make sure that you uh, check out our tool. And videos. if you have any recommendations of, of some tools that we might need or storage ideas, yes, yeah, storage. Drop ideas. it down below. Okay, guys, because this is what we have. I mean. We honestly should buy one more. Like you could tell. These and buy one big box. Yeah, you could tell I focus more on that box and this box organizing than those over there yet. I mean, these aren't bad. I mean, what do you got in here? Some just random wrenches. That was Nothing. Empty. Parts. <laughs> oh, this is this is for the 350. Yep. Guys, check that out. That. All that's for the 350. I forgot. The top one's ratchets, I think. Yeah. Yeah, ratchets. All ratchets and breaker Dude, bars. this ratchet right here. If you remember that, it's from the 283, 283. video. I, this is a 3 8 This is a Husky USA. I've had this thing for, for a long time. Years. And I have broke my lawnmower blades loose with it. I, I can't believe it still works. Like, it's insane. Yeah. Broke down at 283, and you know how seized up that thing was. Yeah, it was bad. Was that we already right? did we that already one. Did What's in this one? Oh, that's our team. Team tools. We moved it over there. Yeah. And that's uh, our Milwaukee. Milwaukee. Door. I don't know what this is. That's our cobalt and I. Oh yeah. I forgot and the we other had those. one below that's just a junk drawer with our paperwork. Oh yeah, paperwork. Like Let's and see this what one I here. haven't really messed with much. Okay, that's a bunch of just things random. we need to organize. Did we have? Uh, that's for a welding stuff. Yep. 
But what we need to do, okay. That's metric. Metric, which we don't do much of in the shop. That's just. Hey, there's random. our cut wheel. Yeah, that's our cut wheel. And that's our grinding Which, guys, stuff. we got an air compressor coming soon. Yes, and here's all of our hammers and uh, interior Those tools. Those are terrible, though. Those are horrible. We got to buy some good ones. And then random parts. Uh, like pulleys. That's the Mustang's windshield wipers. Yes. Mustang mirror. There's their steering wheel puller. And the rest is that's nothing. That's parts down there. There's the um, brake, boot, brake booster down there. Yep. So, guys. Um, we're going to have to paint these valve covers. We're going to paint these valve covers. Tomorrow we when we get the paint. Yeah. Because we got to get the paint. And then, guys, we'll see where we get. Guys, because I, I don't know. There's a tool I need, guys. And I want you to tell me where I can get it. You adjust it to put the rings in here. And it sets it in square so you can filler gauge it to cut them down. A lot of times, people just turn a piston upside down and do it. Yeah. Put squared in there. I, that might be what we do this time, but I want the tool, the real tool for it. Anytime we can get a new tool, we love it. Yeah, just let us know where we can pick it up at. What Maybe Speedway or something. Yeah, there's this one tool, I'm, a hammer I'm wanting. It's unnecessary, but, but I do want You got to think, I beat them out with rebar and all these little sledgehammers. I beat out pistons. But when we're putting in pistons, we use the back of a hammer. Yeah, we use the one wood of those, part. Uh, soft blows, yeah. orange, and tap it in. But... But Snap-on makes a piston hammer. Piston hammer, and it's but really I don't long. know if it's worth the money. How, well, how much is it? I think eighty nine dollars or something. Eighty nine dollars. We don't know. I mean, that could be just a waste of money. It probably is. But, guys, but we might get it later on down the road. But you've seen the parts we had in there for this motor. Then we have all this, and then we got the the timing chain and the oil pan out there drying and black. So we'll paint these tomorrow and see where we're at. So see you tomorrow. All right, guys, let's get these painted now. We went and picked up our paint. Yep. We'll see. Oh, now I gave away what color it is. I already told them. <laughs> yeah, but we didn't tell them one thing. Oh, we haven't told them yet. Are we going to go, tell them? Go ahead and tell them. Guys, this is Ford Red. On, a Chevy, on a Chevy motor. motor. <laughs> Don't judge. It's the only engine paint that was the right red. That we was looking for. Cause we didn't want the Chevy orange red because we're going for more after red. Yeah, cause our theme on this truck's gonna be red. And red and, and black. Red and black. And we're wanting a motor to kind of flow with the car. Flow with the truck. Or a truck, yeah. Sorry. Oh, that's gonna look good, ain't it? Oh yeah. We'll have to put a couple coats on it, I'd say. Well, with red, you always have to because it don't cover as well as black does. That's gonna look so good. Whose table is this? Crazy Dave. Oh, God. sorry, Dave. <laughs> I think it's his. I think so, but here, once he left it here, Sessions nine tenths of the nine law. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna look good though. So we'll show you after this coat's dry. All right, guys. Well, we got the timing chain painted, the oil pan painted. These are gonna be red like this. Oh yeah. So guys. Make sure that you like, subscribe, and thanks for watching. Peace.